Jack, are you sure you've never managed a concert before? Well, it turns out doing up a concert's the same as setting up a rodeo. And thanks to Pinky's Connections organizing the Pony Palooza Rock Concert, we've got quite a lineup for the Helping Hooves Music Festival. Oh, wait, that's me. Every pony! What is it, Pinky? I have the most amazing news ever. It is totally gonna break your friend! Well, spill it, Pinky! It wasn't easy. In fact, it was terribly difficult. But I have managed to book the biggest pony pop star in all of Equestria as the main attraction of the Healthy Hubs Music Festival! Sapphire Shores? Sapphire Shores? Please! Sapphire Shores is merely the second biggest pony pop star in Equestria. I have booked the one, the only, Countess Coloratura! Ah. Who in the hay is Countess Coloratura? <gasps> My friends have been freaked! <laughs> Tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness. It's an easy feat. And magic makes it all complete. You have mine. Do you know you are my very best friends? Pinkie Pie, who is this Countess Coloratura pony? Uh, I just told you that she's the biggest pony pop star in a how, 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 how have you not heard of her? Don't know. Though I did know a gal named Coloratura when I was just a filly. <laughs> Wouldn't it just be the funniest thing if that Coloratura and this Coloratura were the same Coloratura? <laughs> Do you mean to tell me that you actually know Countess Coloratura? Well, I don't think it's the same pony since my friend wasn't any sort of highfalutin countess. Do you remember her cutie mark? Sure do. It had this super colorful bunch of musical notes that just shimmered in the light. You mean, like this? Well, fancy that. That there's the very same cutie mark. Do you have any idea the number of hoops I had to jump through to get her to perform at the festival? A whole lot of hoops! That pony is very demanding! No. Yeah! I completely understand. We artists require certain necessities in order to do our best work. This was clearly some sort of misunderstanding. Cause Rara was just as down home as me. Rara? Even that big name was too fancy for her. So I shortened Colora Chura to Rara. We had the best time at Camp Friendship. Rara was just so easy going. We were like two apples from the same branch. Rara and I prepared this song for the camp talent show. When we performed, she belted it out, singing in the most colorful, clear voice I'd ever heard. Equestria, the land I love, a land of harmony. Our flag does wave from high above, for pony kind to see. Equestria, a land of friends, where pony camp, we wrote to each other for a bit, but then we lost touch. But Rara always did want to go to Manhattan to try and make it big. But a demanding diva? Just you wait, Pinky. Once Rara gets here, you'll see she's just a plain old pony like you and me. I don't have to wait! She's here! Really?
Step back! Keep your hooves and tail to yourselves! No, that can't be her. <clears throat> um, hi. Remember me? We met at Camp Friendship. I, I gave you the nickname Rara. AJ? Yeah! <laughs> Howdy, Rara! Hoosies! <laughs> Ooh, you got hoovesies from Countess Coloratura! Look! Oh, she clearly thinks you're very special! Hoovesies! 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 <laughs> yeah, real special. Now that's how you make an entrance! Big, bold, absolutely stunning! Though it was muddied a bit with your interaction with that dusty farm pony, do you actually know her? Oh yeah, that's my childhood Philly friend, AJ. She was the one that started calling me Rara. Oh yes, how cute and common. Of course, I was the one that started calling you Countess. And just look at how you've moved up in Equestria since then. Why, you've gotten everything you've ever wanted. Speaking of which, where is the pony Pinkie Pie? Ooh, I'm the pony Pinkie Pie, Mr. Manager, sir. Do you have the water imported from Rainbow Falls that I requested for Countess Coloratura? I have 20 glass containers full right here. Did I not tell you to provide straws in all of Countess Coloratura's beverages? Uh, I don't think so. But lucky for you, I have the biggest straw collection in Equestria. I call this straw Fernando. Hmm. Let us confirm that you acquired the rest of the items that Countess Coloratura requested before she performs her run-through, shall we? Oh, we shall. Floral arrangements from the Royal Canterlot Gardens, chocolate eclairs made by Gustave Legrand, a selection of crystals from the Crystal Empire, freshly picked cherries from Cherry Jubilee's farm, separated red from yellow. Absolutely. Well, by some miracle, your requests have been reasonably met. So let us move on to rehearsal. See, Applejack, demanding. Pinky's right, Rarity. The Rara I knew didn't hide behind a veil giving out fake stamp kisses, sipping up imported water, and needing her cherry separated. Oh, I do understand. Sometimes it's hard to see our friends change. She's become a whole other pony. Trust me, once you see Countess Coloratura perform, you simply won't believe it. believe it. Oh, my shining star! Thanks to the sparkling costumes, dazzling choreography, and brilliant vocal effects that I designed, your performance was spectacular, Countess Coloradora. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Sven Gallup. Correct me if I'm wrong here, but that feller isn't actually complimenting Rara. He's complimenting all the bells and whistles he's piled on to make her Countess Coloratura. Oh, no, 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 you don't understand, Applejack. Creating all those elements is a lot of work, and Countess Coloratura's performance wouldn't exist without them. If you ask me, that wouldn't necessarily be a bad thing. 
Oh, if we're all done here, I'd love to go back to my trailer and rest, Sven Gallop. Actually, right now you're scheduled for your meet and greet with the school ponies. Oh, I can totally get you out of meeting with the school ponies, Countess. Absolutely not. My favorite part of any event is meeting with the school ponies. The school ponies will be so happy to hear that, Rara. Ponyville School Ponies! As part of the Helping Hooves Music Festival, I'm holding a contest where some of you will get a chance to sing with me on stage at the concert tomorrow! Sound fun? Yeah! yeah! All right! Now who wants more hoopsies? Yeah! Now that's more like the raw rot I remember. But I got everything you requested! That! was for Countess Coloratura. This is for me. And what I want is premium oats. Oh, well, we have lots of tasty oats right here in Ponyville. I would not feed those to a chicken. I want top of the line Appaloosan oats. Next, it appears that we are surrounded by apple trees. Bring me 500 pre-peeled, pre-cored apples, and I want those things in 24 hours. But that's impossible. Do you want me to pull Countess Coloratura from your little podunk charity show? Because I will. Applejack, Sven Gallop just made all of these new demands and he said... I heard, Pinky, but don't you fret. I'll talk to Rara and fix things right up. Did you see, sis? Did you see? Is this the little sister you wrote to me about, AJ? Hold on, Applejack. You wrote to Countess Coloratura... About me? AJ said you were the best little sister ever, Apple Bloom. All right now. You best get along, little ponies. <laughs> uh, hey, Raw Raw, you mind if I talk to you about your manager? Sure, what about him? Well, while you were meeting with the school ponies, he was demanding all sorts of stuff from Pinkie Pie. Sven Gallup works very hard as my manager, AJ, so if he needs some things when we're on the road, I, I don't see anything wrong with that. Well, do you see something wrong with him telling Pinky that if she doesn't get those things by tomorrow, he'd pull you from our charity festival? What? But he knows how important charity is to me, and leaving the festival would completely ruin my image. I'm afraid Sven Gallup doesn't give a pickle pippin' about your charity work. That's not true. Sven Gallup has always supported me in all my interests. You're just saying those things because you're jealous. Jealous of what? A pony who hides behind a veil so thick she can't see when some pony's using her? No, <laughs> I'm not jealous of that, Rara. I am not Rara. I am Countess Coloratura. And while we may have been friends when we were young, we have clearly gone in different directions. It just ain't right. He's manipulating her, and she's just not saying it. Enough stewing. More peeling! Sorry, Pinky, but there is no way I'm letting that lousy Sven Gallop use my friend like that. Aww. Countess Golovichura! Wow, AJ, you said my real name. I said your new name, but I saw the real you hanging out with those school ponies yesterday. And I know some pony that'd prefer if you stop doing those little events. Ugh, not this again. Come on now. You just gotta give me a chance to prove what I'm saying is true. And just how are you going to do that? Do exactly what I say. We'll see if that Sven Gallop truly has your best interests at heart. Sven Gallop? Sven Gallop? Where are you, Sven Gallop? Here I am. Did you need something? Yes. I was considering maybe canceling the contest with the school ponies. Countess, this is wonderful. I've been waiting forever for you to cancel that pointless school pony contest. You have? You do it at every charity event, and it does absolutely nothing to promote the Countess Coloratura image that I built. <laughs> Consider it canceled. Pinkie Pie? <laughs> yes? We're making some adjustments to the show. Follow me.
cancel the contest for the Phillies and schedule me a spa treatment. Now that I don't have to oversee a rehearsal with those brats, I have time for the works. <laughs> you know the drill. Deliver, or the diva ditches your dippy charity. Okay, Countess Coloratura, all taken care of. You know the drill. Deliver, or the diva ditches your dippy charity. So that's how you've been managing things? Yeah, so, what's the problem? The problem is, is you've been using my name to intimidate ponies to get what you want. But I work incredibly hard for you. I deserve everything I get. But not because you scare ponies into thinking I won't perform for their charities otherwise. I would never do that to my fans, which is why you should have known that I would never cancel the school ponies contest. Hmm. <laughs> All this charity and school pony contest nonsense is just remnants of that boring little rah-rah I met back in Manhattan. You clearly don't understand the real me. <laughs> That's a joke. I made you some pony. What can you even do without me? Good luck, Countess Coloratura. Good luck. Oh, rah-rah. I'm so sorry. Are you going to be okay for the concert tonight? Of course. After all, the show must go on. Oh my gosh, Rarity. Sven Gallop's right. This is going to be a disaster. I'm going to be terrible. Can you give us a minute, Rarity? Certainly. Now, why is it going to be so terrible? Because Sven Gallop was in charge of everything. The lights, the visuals, the sound. Without Sven Gallop, I have nothing. Now, now, don't go getting yourself into a tizzy there, Rara. Sven Gallop turned you into Countess Coloratura and acted like your friend so we could enjoy the perks that came with being a star. But the real perk of friendship is getting to see your friend being true to their self. And Rara, when you're simply yourself, you're the brightest star I've ever seen shine. night of the Helping Hooves Music Festival. Now it is my great honor to introduce you to our headlining act, Countess Coloratura! This song may be familiar, but yet it's totally different. Kind of like me, Rara. Huh? show you who I am throw off the veil it's finally time there's more to me than glitz and glam oh, oh. and now I feel my star Music Festival. 
festival, I have forgotten who I really was. But then an old friend reminded me what real friendship is about, and she told me that if I was true to myself, I couldn't go wrong. So I have a very special surprise for her. Apple Bloom, Sweetie Belle, Scootaloo, come on up. Equestria, the land I love, a land of harmony. Our flag does wave from high above for pony kind to see. 